there is a dua I heard this Allahu latifum bi ibadihi maasmi shayfir di wal kabiyul aziz or kabiyul abzi or something like that. They say to uh, recite it in the morning and uh, also surah yasin in the morning and uh, surah waqia after. Uh, yeah, you, like my Greek yeah, second but question. I'm not sure about these things. Uh, I why? just heard that's so why I want to play it up. I got your second question, and I, I believe answering these two questions will make you a sheikh already. With regards to the morning azkar or evening azkar, there is nothing prescribed to recite Surah Yasin every morning or every evening. And the hadith with regards to the recitation of Surah Al Waqi'ah in order to prevent poverty is extremely weak hadith. You want to know what to do and what to recite in the morning and evening according to the sound hadith? There is a beautiful little book which is known as the Fortress of the Muslim. It's a pocket size. Uh, it is not handy. You cannot purchase it. Go ahead and download the app, the Fortress of the Muslim, the morning and evening Al-Kar. Only the profound and the sound Al-Kar and the sound verses and the sound chapters. Look, it's beautiful to recite the entire Quran 24-7. I love Surah Yasin. I love it so much. It was among the first surahs that we memorized and we were told a lot about Surah Yasin, and it has great meanings. But if anyone volunteers to say, oh Yasin, if you recite it seven times, you get what you want, I'm going to ask him. I'm going to have to ask him. Says who? If anyone dares to say, well, my Sheikh said he tried it and it does work, then I'm going to put a big X on him and his sheikh because my sheikh is bigger than your sheikh. My sheikh is Prophet Muhammad sallallahu Only Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, is the one who has the right to say, you need to recite this supplication three times or one time or four times or seven times at this time or at that time. If while sitting and you're making dhikr and you say subhanallah walhamdulillah then you say allahu latifun bi'ibadi allahu latifun bi'ibadi enjoy when you become regular and you say because it is prescribed to say it ten times in the morning and recite surah yaseen after fajr every day i'm gonna have to ask you says who if you fail to answer this question then do it please for allah's sake you know what happens when we stick to the guidance of prophet muhammad to what he's prescribed Wallahi, you will not have time to innovate adhkar or certain recitations because what he has already prescribed is sufficient for the time. Barakallahu fikum.